ayobora etumije inama yamuhuje na bagenzi be kuganira ku kibazo bibazo byari muri Congo DRC cyo gihe nk'umuyobozi w'umuryango wa African Union itariki 2023 haba inama ikomeye muri Davos World Economic Forum Davos aho nanone kwa Prezida wa Repubulika ni ntumwa yarayoboye bagiranye ibiganiro bitandukanye n'abashora mari nabandi bantu bakomeye kwisi iyo nayo yari inama yingira kamaro cyane itariki 10 itariki ya mbere y'ukwezi kwa kabiri habaye inama y'ibihugu bya by'umuryango East African Community ibera rusha ndetse muri iyo nama niho urwanda eh rwa torewe kuyobora uyu muryango kumara igihe cy'umwaka umwe na nyakuba wa president republica atorwa kuba umuyobozi w'umuryango wa African wa East African community itariki cyenda kugeza 11 z'ukwezi kwa kabiri aba inama y'umuryango wa African Union aho eh nyakuba president republica yeramaze igihe ayobora umuryango yeramaze umwaka ayobora umuryango eh igihe kerero cyari kirangiye uwo muryango utangira kuyoborwa na president w'igihugu cy'a Misiri eh nebyiri habaye kitwa World Government Summit Dubai nayo nyakuba president republika yaretumwemo nk'umu ishitsi mukuru ndetse na Milken Summit Africa Summit Abu Dhabi tariki 13 tariki 14 habaye inama mpuza mahanga ku rwego rw'umutekano mu dage yitwa Munich Security Conference iyo nayo yako president republika yayitumemo nk'umuyobozi umwe mu bayobozi bake kuri uyu mugabane bari batumemo nere yitabiriye ndetse avaho ajya mu nama yahuje abashora mari benshi mu mujyi wa Charlotte North Carolina nkuko mubizi uko kwezi gutangiye tariki ya mbere tariki ya kabiri habaye inama nsebikira muco yabereye muri Burkina Faso Fespaco ndetse Fespaco yari imaze imyaka umaze imyaka 5 igihugu cyacu rwanda rukaba rwari rwatumiwe nk'igihugu nka special guest inkaba nshimira abanyarwanda bitabiriye iki gikorwa cya Fespaco aho umu hango wisoza nyakuba president republika yagize mu ruhare rukomeye ariko nashimira abanyarwanda muri rusange ko bitwaye muri iki gikorwa cyari gi komeye berekana umuco nyarwanda ndetse nkabangira ngo nshimire ababonye ibihembo bitandukanye eh Joel Karekezi mwarabyumvise filimu ye yise The Mercy of Django yabaye yahawe mu dari etalon d'or de Yenenga nagira ngo rero mushimire shimire nabanye banyarwanda bitabiriye iki gikorwa n'uburyo muri rusange u Rwanda abanyarwanda mu byiciro bi bitandukanye bahagarariye igihugu cyacu urumva rero ku mwaka watangiranye ibikorwa byinshi ariko ibyo bikorwa biracyakomeza biracyakomeza hari uko mubizi uyu mwaka itariki ya 25 tariki ya 26 z'uko gatatu tureteganya kwakira the Africa CEO Forum ni na maiza huza 
bacuruzi bakomeye ku mugabane wa Afrika bakuru bihugu bamwe abayobozi mu nzego zitandukanye bazaba baje kuganira ku iterambere rya Afrika no guteza imbere ubucuruzi muri rusange nje ngo rero mbakangurire abanyarwanda muri rusange kuzabigira mu ruhare gukomeza kwakira abashyitsi bacu neza ariko no kureba uburyo izinama zose zaza eh twazungukiramo uyu munsi muri convention center hari inama ihuza abagize ubuzima nama y'ubuzima muri rusange Africa Health Financing eh na yirimo abantu benshi bariho baganira ku buzima mu minsi kandi iri imbere tarike 8 kugeza ku tarike 12 zo ku kwezi yateganijwe umwiherero umwiherero wabayobozi b'igihugu cyacu eh na yo ni inama ngaruka mwaka ariko ni inama ihuza abayobozi kugira ngo baganire ku bibazo eh igihugu cyabagifite ndetse ungurane n'ibitekerezo ku iterambere ry'igihugu cyacu uyu mwaka rero kazaba uri uzaganira ku bintu byinshi ariko cyane cyane no kureba gusuzuma aho Rwanda rugeze mu iterambere ryarwo eh kureba uburyo ireme ry'uburezi ni ireme ry'ubuzima byakomeza gushimangirwa no kunozwa eh kureba uburyo ubuhinzi nubworozi bwakomeza gutera imbere kurushaho eh ndetse nuburyo twakomeza guteza imbere ibikorwa bituma dushobora kohereza ibintu bitandukanye mu mahanga yabari made Rwanda ariko nibindi abanyarwanda bakora bikeneye kujya masoko muza mahanga ibi ni ibintu by'ingenzi kuberako nkuko mubizi mu cyerekezo cyacu 2025 urwanda rugomba guhora rwisuzuma kugira mu muvuduko igihugu cyacu gifite eh uzakomeze mu myaka iri imbere uyu mwaka kandi muri iki gihembwe wenda igitaha gitangira nibwo tuzibuka ku nshuro ya 2025 eh genocide yakorewa yakorewa abatutsi eh icyo nkuko mubizi iteka twibuka twiyubaka tushimangira ubumwe bwacu eh imyaka 2025 yari rageze ubwo abanyarwanda tuzongera twibuke ariko tuni yubaka turushaho kwiyubaka turushaho guteza imbere eh ubumwe bwacu nibindi bikorwa bituma urwanda ruriho kandi ruzabaho kandi rukomeza kubaho mu buryo buhamye kuva tariki 14 na 17 zo kwa gatano azaba Transform Africa Summit Transform Africa Summit zahuza abantu barenze ibihumbi bine mu gihugu cyacu baje kureba cyane cyane kuganira kuri kuri izi gahunda Africa ifite zo guteza imbere ikora na buhanga byabari mu ituma naho ariko no mu bindi bintu bitandukanye aho dukenera ikora na buhanga nagira ngo rero ntangire mvuga ku uyu mwaka watangiranye ibikorwa byinshi kandi bikomeza ibyo ni bimwe gusa eh mvuze bizaza muri aya meza ari imbere ariko umwaka wose uzakomeza kuvuga ko umuvudu ku Rwanda rufite rwifuza no gukomeza kugira eh uzakomeza muri uyu mwaka ubwo namwe ari abanyarwanda batwumva ariko ari nabanyamakuru mwese muri aha ubwo ibyo ni ibikorwa byanyu nagira ngo twibukiranye gusa ibyo tuzakora muri iyi minsi iri imbere reka wende mbe mpini yaho icyo narangirizaho nuko kubijyanye na ministere nyoboye ko bwumwe hariko muri iyi minsi turateganya ko tuzahura tuzahuza abambasaderi bose bari 
urwanda aho bari bose kugira ngo umwaka utangire twese twaganiriye turi kumwe twumvikana bigiye gukorwa muri uyu mwaka dusuzuma byakozwe mu mwaka ushize ariko tureba nibigiye gukorwa mu myaka muri uyu mwaka kugira ngo natwe ni wagize ministeri y'ubanye n'amahanga n'ubutwererane tugire tukomeze gutanga umusaruro mu bikorwa by'iterambere by'igihugu cyacu eh we can wenda mimpini yaho i can would be happy to take questions if if there are any murakoze nkuko nabivuze tugitangira turakira ikibazo kimwe kimwe mu nyamakuru aravuga amazina ye gitangaza no kurakora hanyuma abaze ikibazo mu rurimi yifuza turahera kuri no rwande murakoze nitwa Christopher Itayezu umunyamukuru wa nonaha.com muri imisi eh uh, mazimisa avuga ikibazo uh, cy'u Rwanda na Uganda gakaka uh, imiba umubano tameze neza yango ndetse havuzwe uko numupaka wafunzwe eh bivuga mu itangaza makuru ndetse na Uganda irabyemeza kwa yango mukire icyo mbitubwiraho ndetse ni no 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 kudaboringa cyase kongera imisoro ku bintu biva muri Uganda byiza mu Rwanda ndetse no nikijyanye no kuvuga ko urwanda rwa diployinza abasirikare beshi kupaka bikaba biteye impungenge aba bagande cy'abanyarwanda bahatuye yango mu gira icyo mu bitubwiraho murakoze we take one at a time okay it's fine uko mubishaka ngira ngo kuri icyo kibazo harimo dukwe gutandukanya ibintu byinshi ni kibazo gikomeye mu ibintu byinshi reka mpere ku cy'umupaka eh nkuko nabisobanuye ntabwo imipaka y'u Rwanda ifunze nta mupaka numwe w'u Rwanda ufunze eh ikibazo gihari ni construction kubaka kuri ho gukorwa ku mupaka wa gatuno one stop by the post abari gatuna murahazi ko hateye na hantu hafunganye ntabwo ntabwo ari one border post imeze nk'izindi tukubaka handi za rusumo na handi hari ahantu harambuye hamwe na hamwe oya so icyo kibazo rero ni kibazo cyo kubaka yo one border post twibwira ko izarangira muri aya mezi ngira ngo bigomba kurangira nko mu kwezi kwa gatano byatumye dusaba eh abacuruzi cyane cyane abantu bafite amakamyo na bus n'ibiki ko batakoresha gatuna bakaba bakoresha ka gitumba bagakoresha eh na cyanika iyo mipaka irafunguye izindi modoka zishobora gucaho gatuna isanwa zo zigakomeza so ibyo nibyo biriho bikorwa ubu ngubu habaye bibazo eh bigitangira ngira ngo ku tariki ya 28 ariko the traffic iri hiragende gabanuka ku mipaka kuberako harimo abantu batinze kubahiriza icyo ke cyo cyemezo amakamyo atinda kwinjira gatuna aranafunga nabashaka guhindukira birananirana so habaye imibibazo bike ariko nibwira ko uburo bikemuka so by'imipaka nta mupaka ufunze ibindi numva mwarimo bajije ngo bye byingabo ku mupaka ntangabo ziyongereye ku mupaka oya ntabwo cyabe ikibazo urwanda rufite uburenganzira bwo gushyira ingabo zarwo aho rushaka aho rubona ko bikenewe ariko ntangabo ziyongereye ku mupaka ibikorwa bya gisirikare n'iby'umutekano birakomeza nk'ubusanzwe eh abanyarwanda bo bararinzwe bihagije ariko nta 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 mpamvu nta mpamvu yo kongera ingabo ngira ngo ni sinza abantu babikwije kwije mu binyamakuru ariko ntabwo ari byo byari bihuha ibyo ibyo ntabwo ari byo so icyo ni ikibazo kimwe 
kijyanye n'imipaka eh ibindi bibazo warubajije byumubano na Uganda mbono na Uganda nawo eh uzagenda neza harimo ibibazo bungubu ariko ariko ndiye tuzi neza kuzagenda neza turabaturanye eh yabantu baturanye habamo ibibazo kandi turo turabiganira ndizera ko bizagenda neza gusa hari ibibazo kandi nabyo twarabisobanuye ntabwo ari ibibazo bishya ntabwo ari bwo bigitangira ni ibibazo bimaze hafi imyaka ibiri biganirwaho mu nzego zitandukanye eh nkuko twari twabisobanuye ni ibibazo bitatu turo dushakira umuti ikibazo cy'ambere ni ikibazo cy'aba cy'abanyarwanda bakomeje gufatwa bagahohoterwa bagafungwa bakakicwa urubozo bagafungirwa ahantu eh, hatazwi muri Uganda ni ikibazo gikomeye eh, tumaze kugira abantu barenga ijana na mirongo icyenda na ba, ba bafashwe muri ubwo buryo so, ni ikibazo kandi kitarabonerwa umuti kugeza ubu abandi babafungura bakabazana bakagira ku mipaka y'u Rwanda ari intere bameze nabi those who are deported bamwe bagasigaye imiryango yabo abandi bagasigaye za business zabo abandi bakabuzwa burenganzira bari bafite bagasigaye abana babo ari imiryango ifunze ifite abana bato ubona eh na gisubizo ubonera ku kuri icyo kibazo bamwe bafite bashakishije abanyamategeko bajya mu nkiko zo muri kiriya gihugu kugira ngo barebe ko byibura e, bagera kuri abo bantu babo na leta y'u Rwanda ikomeza gusaba tuti tutivanze mu bibazo bya Uganda n'icyo abo bantu babafungiwe tutabyivanzemo ariko twifuza kumenya aho mu Rwanda ari uko yaba ameze n'icyo yabafungiwe ibyo rero nta gisubizo tubonera e, muko nabivuze bakuru bihugu cyo ibyo bibazo barabiganiriye kuva nyako wa president republika hore na mugenzi we Addis Ababa nyaka ibiri giye gushira barabiganira kumara iminsi ibiri ndetse rongera ajya kumureba muri Uganda barongera barabiganira intumwa ziroherezwa e, tubishyira mu nyandiko nyinshi ntabwo ari nyandiko ndi konyishi eh urwanda rurabiceceka uretse kubiganira nyine biganira na mugenzi wanje ministre ubishinzwe so, ambassade yacu ibihoramo so, ni ikibazo kimaze gihe kirekire tutarabonera igisubizo kandi twifuza ko eh, cyabonerwa igisubizo akaba ariyo mpamvu tuvuga tuti gihe tutarabonera igisubizo kuri iki kibazo gihari turasaba abanyarwanda wabirinze kujya muri Uganda kugira ngo tuzabanze tumenye neza icyo kibazo aho kiri ubutumaze kugira abanyarwanda babaye deported barenze 1986 eh murumva rero ko icyo kibazo cyo kirahari ikibazo cyakabiri nkuko nabisobanuye ni ikibazo cy'abantu bashaka gute guhunga abanyu mutekano w'u Rwanda barimo RNC bari mu FDL nabandi bakorera ibikorwa byabo muri Uganda bakoranye nabayobozi bamwe bo muri Uganda icyo nacyo ni ikibazo kandi nabyo twabigejeje kuri Uganda turifuza ko nabyo byabonerwe igisubizo e, ikibazo cyagatatu e, nacyo dukomeza kuganira ni ibibazo abacuruzi bacu bakomeje kugira yo bari muri kirya gihugu baba bacamo cyangwa se bakoreramo ibikorwa byabo aba abamburwa uburenganzira ku bikorwa byabo bakorerayo 
abo igira batya ukabona ibintu byacagamo birafashwe birafunzwe bimaze amezi tukabaza reko se bimwe bifatiye iki ko inzandiko zose zihari hagera igihe bimwe bakabirekura eh bindi ntibabirekure nkuru murabizi amatayos yacaga Uganda aje handi nta gicayo yarafunzwe amatava mu Rwanda ibindi bya bya minerals byo bageza aho barabifungura barabirekura bimaze amezi na amezi bi tutazi no bifunzwe ari we ariko birari kurwa ukabazo se kubirekura ni byiza ariko ubundi byari byafatwe kuberike so ari byo ibyo bibazo tutarabonera ibisubizo ariko nibwira ko nabyo ibisubizo bizaboneka niko bimeze so ariko umutekano wacu umeze neza ndetse nubu nimibanire yacu ni igihugu cya Uganda turakomeza kuganira kugira ngo ibibazo ibibazo bihari bibonerwe ibisubizo kubera ko umutekano umubano wo ugomba kumera neza no gukomeza kumera neza nibyo twifuza nibyo turiho duharanira Marcoze turafata kibazo kuri Rwanda Imishinga yagiye nda neza ari 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 bya ari bya amashanyaraze eh mwavugaga eh ari ya rusizi rusizi ya gatatu ndetse no gukora rusizi ya kane arasanzweho rusizi ya mbere rusizi ya kabiri eh ibyo byo imishinga yo ubwayo yarakomeje kandi muri rusange ragenda neza methane gas yaratangiye gukoresha n'isari n'abashora mari babonetse bagiye kongera megawatts ziva muri methane gas kuko side y'u Rwanda ari indi mishinga itagenda neza kubera ibibazo bitandukanye nk'imishinga y'ubuhinzi kigo cya Iraz kiri bujumbura kidako kiri kiri ntabwo kiri bujumbura kiri mu Burundi duhuriyeho cyari gishinzwe guteza imbere ubuhinzi ariko ubona kitagenda neza cyo so icyo ngicyo gifite ibibazo hari bank duhuriyeho yo ya BDG iri goma nayo icumbagira kubera ibibazo bitandukanye tumaze iminsi so iya energy bona igenda neza ibindi birasa n'ibicumbagira ariko CPG iyo nk'umuryango ufite nawe ora cyafite ibibazo turebe ko iba byakemuka cyangwa se ibyo twakoreraga muri CPG twabikora ukundi kubera ko ifite ibibazo eh inzego zibuyoboye ukabona ntabwo zihura ngo zifate ibyemezo bisa nibyagoranye eh ben abakozi bawukorera ukabona bihugu ntibitanga amafaranga yabyo ku gihe so harimo ibibazo by'imikorere ya secretariat tumaze imisi tuganira turebe uko dushaka uko byakemuka aida tubikemure umuryango ukore neza cyangwa se bikorwa byawo dushaka uburyo bundi twabikomeza wenda bitari mu rwego rwa CPG ibyo nibyo biganiro biriho biba mu rugero hari hari bikorwa bimwe ubona byakorerwa muri ECAS umuryango uhuza ibihugu byo muri Central Africa wenda umuntu ya ya kura muri CPG rakabijyana muri muri uwo muryango eh ariko kugera ngo byemezo bifatwe nanone bisaba ko inama zihura ari inama za ministry ari inama za bakuru bihugu kugira ngo bafate ibyemezo 
ibyo rero ntabwo birakunda kubera impamvu zitandukanye ariko ndi ndizera ko bizakunda muri imese kuri northern corridor eh hari mi za projects zimwe zakomeje kandi zikora neza muri rusange za mi bibazo ari kubundi zikora neza ibintu bya id em ariko hari yindi mishinga yadindiye nyo mwari mubajije ya ya pipeline yagombaga kuva Uganda igasha mu Rwanda ibyo ubona byaradindiye ibyo mwavugaga bya gari ya moshi nayo byaradindiye ndetse nibyo amashanyarazi amashanyarazi yagombaga guca muri Uganda kaza mu Rwanda nabyo byaradindiye nabyo abantu babiganiriye kenshi bona bitarabona igisubizo gifatika kuba ari yo mpamvu urwanda rwo eh rwakomeje n'indi mishinga iri muri central corridor ibintu biva Dar es Salaam biza bice mu rusumo byinjira gari ya moshi za Baisaka nayo ikaza mu Rwanda ibyo nabyo ibyo byo biriho biragenda neza urabona harajemo hari umuvuduko ushimishije twizera ko umuvuduko uzakomeza northern corridor rero imishinga ya dindi turo turacyashikisha gihe abantu ibihugu bigize northern corridor byahura kugira ngo twongere tuganire kuri iyi mishinga ya northern corridor itagenda neza ndizera ko bizaba bwo ndiko mukwezi kwa gatano we'll take our next question from this side I uh, had the same question as my colleague. I just wanted to request that you kindly uh, answer it in English, if that would be possible. No, why don't you ask the question? The question so is that, that I can answer it. Otherwise, if I answer his question in English, it will be complicated. All right. Uh, uh, in line with the with the conflict that has been going on between Rwanda and Uganda, I just wanted to know that. Uh, uh, what is being done in in line with that especially now that Rwanda is uh, the bigger person in the East Africa community and of course the the issues that have been uh, encountered at the Gatuna border there has been different views uh, on on what's happening and uh, I'll just like to, uh, for clarity in that in that line yes i i um, i think it is I've seen a lot of uh, confusion a bit amalgamation of issues um, and some outright disinformation about what is happening so let me be, may, let me explain um, first of all it is important to separate border issues from other issues as far as the border is concerned uh Rwanda's borders with all our with all our neighbors are open on the Rwandan side all the borders are open there is a challenge with Gatuna because there is an ongoing construction of the one stop border post this construction we hope will be concluded by May late May I think that is uh, the timeline now but in order to speed up construction given that terrain of Gatuna the terrain of Gatuna is it's, it's a narrow gorge uh, it, it's a quite a complicated terrain even designing that one stop border post was a challenge because of the, t the nature of that terrain itself but in order to fasten uh, to hasten that construction mm -hmm. we have requested all heavy trucks and vehicles heavy vehicles to use alternative entry points into Rwanda from Uganda use Kajitumba use Chanika those uh, light traffic that 
can use Gatuna without impeding the work continues. That is going on well. We had a challenge because for, for, from the 21st, Gatuna was clogged up uh, for many reasons. Some truck drivers not responding quickly enough to use alternative routes. Um, some was a point at which they couldn't turn, those who wanted to turn. So there, there were quite a series of logistical issues clogged up um, um, Gatuna. But now it's going to, it's moving on Kajitumba and Chanika. Of course, because one border post is not functioning maximally, there is a bit of pressure on the other border posts too, but which are, which are manageable. So that is the border post. Uh, that's what has happened along our borders. I've heard people say borders are closed. No, they've never been closed. Your colleague was asking me about uh, troop deployments, and I told him, no, there are no additional troop deployments on our borders. Um, our, bo our, our country is well defended, and there is no need to do anything extra uh, than what has been done now. So those are the border issues. Now, as to the other issues, which we are, which are under discussion with the government of Uganda. These are not new. These are issues we've been discussing for two years now. Our heads of state met, the president met his colleague in Addis Ababa, discussed this for over a period of two days. They met in Entebbe, the house, they discussed them. They have exchanged Envoys, Rwanda has written, these are in writing, but we have not yet received a, an answer, a satisfactory answer, and hopefully uh, this answer will come, because we still continue talking. And I was explaining that there are only three problems. One is this issue of Rwandans who continue to be arrested, harassed, tortured, incarcerated in Ugandan jails for reasons we don't understand and in breach of international obligations. In breach of international obligations. We have over 100 and 90-something people. These lists have been shared with Uganda over these past two years, as I have explained. They keep being updated. We have some arrested as late as the 28th. So that is a problem. Our position has been that we do not want to interfere in Uganda's internal affairs. We do not even uh, challenge the right of Uganda to arrest people if they think they are criminals. That is not the issue. The issue is if you arrest somebody, first of all, you take them through due process. That is it. You take them through due process, you allow consular access, when we arrest Ugandans here in Rwanda who have committed crimes, they go to our courts of law, but the embassy is immediately informed, the Ugandan embassy here is immediately informed. They don't have to ask. We inform them that so-and-so has been arrested for this reason. This is where they are. And then they can receive consular access. This is standard practice among nations. That is what we have asked for from our colleagues. We have not received it. We have people who have been incarcerated since 2017. Since 2017. They have not had access. They have not had consular access. They have not gone through 
courts of law. Their lawyers have not been able to access them. The, um, the, 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 so, so that is the challenge. Some are arrested. We request for an explanation. A year later, we find them at our borders. They're brought in, dumped, tortured, and we receive them. So that is the challenge. That is the issue we have raised. Uh, and, and we think it is an important issue because for us, the right of these people, if they are our citizens, are important for us to know. But that does not mean we, we interfere. There, I've heard people saying we're interfering. No, 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 we're not interfering. We just want things to be done the way they should be done, the way international law provides for that to be done. We have over 980 people deported from Uganda. Now, of course, again, deportation is a sovereign right. We are not questioning the right of Uganda to deport whoever they think should be deported. But deportation also has procedures you follow. We're asking them to follow those procedures. You do not get people, blindfold them in the middle of the night, transport them, torture them along the way of deportation, and then dump them at a border. That's not the way deportations are done, no. So that's what we're asking for. If, if somebody is doing something, um, the least they can do is explain. But if they don't even want to explain, at least do it the right way. That's all we're asking for. Now, because, but it's also not normal that you would have 900 and something people deported. That's not a normal state of affairs. So which we need to, to discuss. So those are the issues, that the first issue that we have raised. And we will continue to discuss uh, with our colleagues to make sure that this is addressed. Now, because over the last two years, we have not seen any headway on this matter, which affects the lives and of, the, of our own citizens, we have advised them. Rwandan citizens, not to travel to Uganda until these matters are sorted out. It is our responsibility as a government to do so. We have been blamed for acting too late, but as I've explained, it's taken two years for us to take this step of advising our people not to go to Uganda for their own security. But as I explained, Ugandans, East Africans, Africans are welcome to Rwanda. They are free to come in. They are received well. They will continue to be received well. So the advice is to our citizens for their protection. And we hope that um, this matter will be resolved with our colleagues. So that is one set of issues which we have been discussing. The second, which we have been discussing with our colleagues from Uganda, and we will continue to do so, is this alarming thing for us of groups hostile to government of Rwanda, groups which have carried out acts of terrorism inside Rwanda. They've attacked, they carried out attacks in uh, in Kigali here, grenade attacks in the past. They've carried out attacks in the north of our country. They've attacked, they've carried out attacks in the south of our country, the southern province, even as late as last year. The leaders of those groups carrying out the activities in Uganda seemingly freely with the support of some officials 
of the government of Uganda. That is, a, that is a problem we have put at the table. These include the RNC of a man called Kayumba, uh, the FDLR, uh, some of the FDLR people. The FDLR are the people who carried out genocide in this country. Some of those people were arrested in, Uganda, in, in, in DRC on their return from Uganda. And through good cooperation, they've been handed over to Rwanda. They've detailed these activities. And we have shared that information with our colleagues from Uganda and requested for, uh, first of all, that these things stop, because I can't see any explanation for the support. That is the second challenge. This is also has been ongoing. It is not something that is new. The third, which we are also discussing, is that for some reason, Rwandan goods find difficulty either transiting through Uganda or being sold in Uganda. Quite a number of uh, our, of, of some of the Rwandans deported claim that their businesses are closed and then they are deported. Uh, some are people who've been in Uganda for some time. Others are people who just have been carrying out their businesses in Uganda. So they closed, deported, businesses closed, no compensation, no follow-up. That's a challenge. Some of Rwanda's goods, as you know, have been held up in Uganda in the past. We had a whole uh, container of minerals held for months and eventually released. We, don't, we still don't know why this happened. Nobody has explained to us why that happened. We are happy and grateful that it was released. But you can imagine if somebody has a container of things going through a country, we are landlocked ourselves. We access is to Mombasa and Dar es Salaam. So if you, if you tamper with that movement, then for us, it's, as a landlocked country, it's a serious matter because you cause uh, difficulty with investors. You cause, it, it's, it's an issue. There are other things, milk, milk, can't send milk to, through Uganda. So there, there are some of these difficulties for which we have asked for an explanation and we have not yet received an explanation. So those are the three issues we've been handling for, for some time now. Um, they are not new. Maybe the only new thing is that uh, they are public now, but we've been handling them for some time uh, with uh, our colleagues and we will continue to do so because the relationship between Rwanda and Uganda is important for, certainly for Rwanda. And I trust it, it is also important for Uganda. Thanks, Minister. On the same issue of uh, Rwanda and Uganda, we have a question from uh, Twitter, from Luis Jadwong, and he asks, when do we see the roadworks being completed? Roadworks where? Oh. Gatuna border. Oh, it's the one-stop border co post-construction, and um, the, the timeline I, I've been given is uh, May, end of May, uh, works should be completed. Thank you. I will take a question from uh, Bloomberg. Thank you very much. My name is Robert Taylor. I work from Bloomberg. So with the advice of Rwanda not traveling to Uganda, uh, which also includes traders, what's the likely impact of our export, Rwanda's exports to Uganda or transit through maybe to Mombasa? Thank you. Well, Rwandan exports to Uganda are not that high. Uh, I think they're about 19 million. Um, we, we hope um, that these exports will 
eventually continue and pick up. I think if we solve these issues that, that are hampering free trade, then freeway trade uh, uh, can continue. But you see, you cannot have free movement of goods without free movement of people. It's a problem. You cannot say, let the goods move, but I will arrest those who are transporting those goods. It doesn't work that way. You have to first provide the security of the people, and then the goods move, so, which is why we need to, dis to, 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 uh, to solve that problem of people not being free to move. Once that is done, then yes, goods can move easier. So for us, exports are important. We, like I said, we are, we are a landlocked country um, and we, we depend on trade um, with all our neighbors. We, that's why we, regional integration is a, is a strategic pillar of our development strategy. We will continue to do so. It is important for Rwanda. That's why we are champions of regional integration at all levels. We are champions of regional integration. But we are champions of practical things. So let people move freely in safety. Let goods move freely in safety. Yeah, so the focus, goods are important, but people for us are even more important. And this is a challenge which Rwandans will uh, deal with. Um, among the many challenges we've had, uh, this is not the most difficult. We've had much bigger challenges, and Rwandans know how to deal with uh, these challenges. I can assure you that they will not affect our export volumes. They will not affect our uh, growth. They will not affect our security, not affect our safety. Because we know how to grow our economy, even with uh, challenges at, um, at all levels. So that will continue. Thank you. We'll have a question from Gino. I'm from China's Xinhua News Agency, so my question is about China. So uh, during last year, uh, I mean, during last year, uh, Chinese president's visit in Rwanda, the two sides signed document on the Belt and Road Initiative. Uh, so China is going to host the second Belt and Road Forum for international cooperation next month. Uh, what would be Rwanda's expectation of the forum and what's Rwanda's attitude towards the uh, initiative. Thank you very much. Well, first of all, uh, China is, a, is an important partner for Rwanda yeah, at all levels, and we welcome this uh, growing partnership. Uh, China is a partner in our infrastructure development. Uh, we have relations at political levels. We have uh, important relationships that are party to party. We have important relationships that are people to people. So those um, are important relationships which we intend uh, to grow. Uh, in the aftermath of FOCAC, um, we are planning a review meeting with uh, our colleagues from China this quarter on where we are with the different uh, cooperation agreements we have signed. And we intend to intensify uh, this dialogue. So on the basis of this review, we will then see uh, pro measure progress, but also see what needs to be accelerated. As for the uh, Silk and Belt Initiative, it is a good uh, initiative. I think it addresses the development uh, requirements of, of China's partners. Um, I am sure it is certainly for Rwanda. This partnership is mutually beneficial. 
It addresses Rwanda's development challenges, but I'm sure it is also uh, beneficial to uh, the government and the people of China. So we are happy with that, uh, with that relationship. Uh, Hello? Hello? <laughs> Jagatatu, Haribu Murakoze ikibazo cyo cyo Burundi ndibwira ko yavugaga amatora y'u Burundi ntabwo nibwira ko yabazaga amatora yo mu Rwanda ko amatora yo mu Rwanda yo yararangiye ndibwira ko ikibazo cyo Burundi nkuko twabisobanuye kiri mu maboko y'umuhuza w'abarundi umuhuza w'abarundi akaba ari president Museveni wa Uganda Burero iki kibazo cy'u Burundi niwe ufatanya na bagenzi mu rwego rw'umuryango wa Afrika iburasirazuba kugira ngo ibibazo biri i Burundi bikemuke urwanda rwo aho u Burundi ibyo bibazo bizakemukira bakumva batekanye bagera mu bana mwiza n'u Rwanda Rwanda ruza komeza kufungura amaboko yarwo nubundi mipaka nkuko nabisobanuye y'u Rwanda n'u Burundi ku kuri side y'u Rwanda irafunguye eh ibishobora gukorwa birakorwa Rwanda ya yaragi bujumbura mingira ngo nimwe mu muri airlines zifasha kugira ngo eh migende yakiranire y'u Burundi nibindi bihugu ikomeze nubwo hari ibibazo ndumva rero icyo kibazo cyane cyane ari iki Burundi ariko eh umuryango West African Community ibucishije muri president no 7 iherekeza u Burundi kugira ngo wende ibyo bibazo bikemuke ibibazo bya South Africa nabyo byemezo byarafashwe byo ku mubano wa kongera kamera nkuko bimeze mbere ku Rwanda byo nta kibazo kigihari kubitureba kubireba urwanda byo urwanda rufitiye ubushobozi nta kibazo kigihari abantu bo muri South Africa baraza abacuruze baraza bashaka diplomat barahari kuri kurwa byabo so nta kibazo gihari eh ntabwo turake muri kibazo cy'abanyarwanda bashobora kujya muri South Africa ku buryo bworoshye bajyayo ariko biracyagoye ntabwo babona visa ku buryo bworoshye nta so ibyo turacyabiganira ngo turebe ko byakemuka ari ku nzego wenda nko ku rwego rwanje no zindi ziri munsi yacu eh ubona bitihuta bitihuta uko tubishaka eh ariko nabyo nziko bizakemuka ibigomba gukorwa bigakorwa bika bikaba munsi ya icyo bashinwa bashinwa eh ubunda masezerano dufitanye na nabatera nkunga bose nuko bakoresha baza nabantu bakora ibyo abanyarwanda badafite ubushobozi gukora 
ariko kibazo ntabwo ari cyo ntabwo ari bwo ntabwo nibwira ku kibazo ari abashimwa ikibazo n'abanyarwanda abanyarwanda kubera ko twebwe tugomba gukora neza tugakora ibintu binoze tugakora kugira ngo ahubwo natwe abanyarwanda abashimwa bazadushake bajye badutwara ubwo bumenyi tubuhe ngira ngo nico dukomba kwibandaho twebwe nk'abanyarwanda twakora dute ibintu neza vuba binoze kugira ngo ubwo bumenyi nabandi babudushakemo ntabwo rero twavuga gusa ngo tuzajya tubuza abandi ariko twebwe twe gukora ibyo dugomba gukora kugira ngo dukore ibintu bigezweho byiza binoze niba rukubaka eh eh ni burukubaka stade abagomba ku kushiraho eh amabuye amakaro ibyo ugomba gukora babikore neza nicyo kibazo nyira ngo nicyo dukomba twebwe kwibanda nko abanyarwanda abo mwavugaga mwabazaga iyo baje akora kazike akagakora kumanywa akagakora nijoro twebwe abanyarwanda umuntu agera cyo byagera saa 10 n'ebyira ati barankoresha cyane ati ngomba kwitahira ngira ngo nicyo kibazo tugomba kimyumvire tugomba gusubira miteka kugira ngo dukore kurusha uko dukora ubu ngubu ariko ariko amasezerano yera hari yuko eh abaza abaza mu Rwanda baje gukora bakora ibintu tutaragirira ubumenyi ntabwo ari ibintu byose nta ntabwo ari abantu bose bakabaye bapfa kwinjira gusa ko minister mu byemeye twafata ibazo bitanu bya nyuma tugasoza ikiganiro turafata ikibazo muri Rwanda why don't we take a number of them then i can maybe okay. we take now five at a go okay. and then we respond to thank you dekatuhere hari turakwerekwa mu kanya asante mheshimiwa naitwa Edison Bakwe napenda niulize swali langu kwa Kiswahili nafanya kazi na Rafiki Kiswahili Uh, swali so langu litarudi kwenye upande wa matatizo ya Rwanda na Uganda uh, kama mlivyotueleza ni kwamba kwa sasa ni miaka miwili je hamoni kwamba haya matatizo yamefikia uh, kipindi cha kupelekwa kwenye jumuiya ya Afrika Mashariki kwa sababu Rwanda na Uganda ni nchi ambazo ni jumuiya za Afrika Mashariki nashukuru Murakoze nyako wa ministre nitwa Sumta Kaboyi ngorejejwe rya America eh ndagaruka ku rujya n'uruza rwahagaritswe rwo banyarwanda bajyaga muri Uganda ni nacyo mugenzi wanjye wende yaravuze benshi bajyaga yo bakoraga umurimo uh, w'ubucuruzi ndetse byatangiye no kugaragara ku masoko ko harabatangiye kuzamura ibiciro bavuga ko yatewe nuko batakijya kurangura ninda ko byagenze mu Burundi umuntu yakwibaza ngo nti mubona ko iri soko ryo mu Burasirazu ibi bihugu bihuriye muri uyu muryango ubucuruzi bugiye kudindira hanyuma kandi kabazo kamwe mu minsi yashize mwavu urwanda rwavuze ko rwakiriye bari abantu bo muri FDR muvuga ko mu gifite ibyo mubabaza nyuma y'ibibazo muzabaha bigeze he bimeze gute Murakoze dufite ikindi kibazo kuri telefone Hello. Bi, turabumva mwatwibwira. Yitwa Claude ndi kitozi. Yego, kibazo cyanyu. Kibazo cyanjye ndi ndabaza minista. Yese ko hashize imyaka 2 badiringa na Uganda abandika amanyandiko ni batubizwe abanyarwanda bakomeza guhohoterwa. Ese icyo kibazo ni ndiko ni batubizwe nkuko dukeneye gitubizo kiza n'ikitaboneka abanyarwanda azaharanira urenganzira bwa buzaboneka gute ya Uganda yakomeje kutava ku izima turakoze ikibazo cyumvikanye turafata cyanyuma muri no ruhande hanyuma kindi yari ya Clement hanyuma na Thank you very much minister my name is Clement I work with Reuters uh, about that uh, you, you talked of fdr people who were deported to rwanda uh will they be taken to courts where are they and um, talking about uh, rwanda and uganda it looks like the issues 
bigger than the borders. Because you talked of Rwandan who have been tortured, harassed. So it means if, if that continues, even Gatuna border would be closed, even and Rwandans would be still urged not to close to Uganda. And uh, don't you think the fact that RNC, FDRR have activities in Uganda, as you said, that complicates the relations in itself. And finally, we've been looking through the social media and everywhere seeing that there are three senior officers from Rwanda, three generals who have been under house arrested. We want to, to get clarity on that. Thanks. Which ones? Which? It's just from social media that three generals, including Bingira and others, have been arrested, but we want to oh, get it confirmed. Yeah, yeah. this way I was looking. I didn't see the social media. Oh, yeah, Bingira, General Bingira, mm -hmm. uh, General Zamamita, and Rivosha. Thanks. Makoze, it was a Chinese Makoze, it was a Chinese man. Makoze, it was a Chinese man. Makoze, it was a Chinese man. Makoze, Hari mirandi cyenda garabe mu mucyaga cyarwero eh ubuyobozi bw'intara kirondo utangaza ko yaba yaturutse mu Rwanda habiciye mu mukagera ndi ndashaka kubaza cyo kurandura rwanda mwivugaho mu gihe iki kibazo cyonye no kuba mu 2014 nabaza mugize gukomoza ku mana urwanda no Burundi ese impande zo mpa cyo zaho zimo gukora yo ari gikorwa cyamo cyabigeze he kugira ngo hano ngiye uyumwisa mu rakoze Makoze ni byari bazo bitano minister mufata umwe nyo kwisubiza the question um, about whether these issues between Rwanda and Uganda should go to the ESC um, some are already there uh, maybe some will go but we prefer to we had preferred the bilateral approach um, but you are right, for some, some of these technical trade issues, um, some will go to the ESC, no doubt about it. Um, but it is always better if you can resolve issues bilaterally, that, that's, that's the way we, we, we see it. Um, on the Echa Sumta Chava Kibuchuru Zip, ntabwo nibwira ko abacuruzi bakwiye kuzamura ibiciro ngo kubera ko batagiye Uganda tuzi ibintu biva Uganda eh first of all abantu barabifite mu stock cyo ni kimwe ikindi hari na nahandi byava kandi leta irafatanya na private sector kugira ngo turebe ko ibi bibazo biri ku muhura wa ruguru eh bitahungabanya ucuruzi muri rusange mu Rwanda izo ngamba zarafashwe turakorana turi kumwe na ba private sector ibyo birakomeza eh niko bigende yo habaye kibazo iyo iyo ufite iri igihugu kitagera ku nyanja ugomba nyine gukora ku buryo budasanzwe nicyo that's what it means to be landlocked iri kuri Yuri igihugu kitakora ku nyanja ugomba gukora ku buryo budasanzwe. Iyo igihe habaye ibibazo ku muhura wa hagati Central Corridor abantu bishyize hamwe ture buryo ibyo bitahunga abanya eh ubucuruzi eh mu Rwanda bitahunga abanya buryo abanyarwanda bagira ibyo bakeneye kuko icyo nicyo kingenze mu Rwanda ka ibya keneye gukoresha akabigira kana akabigira ku giciro kiza gera kozwe cyo gihe n'ubu biroho birakorwa ngo dufatanye turebe ko umunyarwanda agira ibya keneye byose aho byaba biva hose kandi ku giciro kiza izo rero ngamba zarafashwe ari za ministeri zibishinzwe zifatanije nabikorera ari abayobozi kunze go zitandukanye barimo nabayobozi bibanze kugira ngo ibyo abanyarwanda bifuza 
kandi bafitiye uburenganzira babibone bitabasabye kujya handi ntabwo ari byinshi ne bari amashuri ne bari amavuriro ne bari amazi ne bari umuriro ne bari eh ibiribwa bisanzwe gori bishimbo ibinyumbati ibyo ibyo umunyarwanda keneye akuye kubibona hafi atagombye kugenda ingendo zimujyana kure iyo ni gahunda irimo eh nibwira ko nta kibazo kinene nta kibazo kinene kizaba kuba nyarwanda batuye kuri ya mirenge uko ari 15 eh ikora kuri kugihugu cya Uganda byo hariho abantu bafite ibyo bakeneye byumwe hariko ariko ibyo nabyo turakorana n'abayobozi b'inzego zibanze nabandi nabo abanyarwanda bakabigira mu ruhare kugira ngo ubuzima bwabo bukomeze nkuko busanzwe ndetse bakomeze no kwiyubaka no kwihaza ibyo rero niyo mpamvu leta ishyira ingufu muri made in Rwanda ibintu byose dushobora gukorera iwacu kandi dufite ubushobozi tubikore ni tubikore neza bidutunge nicyo ngira ngo kingenzi so kuri ibi ntabwo nibwira ko yaza bibazo bikomeye kubera ko arabi korera araba abanyarwanda ari nabandi hari ari uburyo bwo kugera kubyo dukeneye twese nk'abanyarwanda eh ibyinshi tukabyikorera ibyo tudashoboye kwikorera tukabikura handi kandi amasoko aragwi numba rero nta nta kibazo kinene kizaba ibyo FDL abayobozi ba FDL bafashwe abayobozi benshi ba FDL ba bari hano eh ara basirikare barenze magani nani bamwe baje bava mu bice bitandukanye bya Kongo bari mutobo nahandi eh hari nabandi babiri nibo baherutse kuza umwe rushinzwe intelligence unde bakore bindi abo nabo bari mu Rwanda barafashwa baza mu Rwanda bameze neza baratanga makuru menshi eh iki ngenzi nuko batashye bari wabo ubwibindi eretiza izaje ubagezaho igihe bibaye ngombwa ariko bari mu Rwanda bafashwe neza ba kandi baratanga makuru meza akenewe eh aba bajije ate suburenganzira abanyarwanda burenganzira bwabo bizagenda gute Uganda tavuye kwizima uburenganzira bw'abanyarwanda ntabwo bushingiye ku bindi bihugu ntabwo uburenganzira bw'abanyarwanda bushingiye kuri Uganda ntabwo bushingiye ku kindi gihugu cyaricyo cyose uburenganzira bw'abanyarwanda bushingiye ku ku Rwanda n'agaciro abanyarwanda biha kandi urwanda ni igihugu cyiyubashye cyiyubaka gifatanya nabandi kubaka eh uyu mugabane turimo urwanda rwo uyu munsi rero rushingiye ku banyarwanda bwabo ntabwo uko umunyarwanda ramuka ukwarya uko yambara uko yivuza uko yiga ntabwo ibyo bigenwa nabandi ntabwo bigenwa nta gihugu na kimwe kuri kwisi kigena uko umunyarwanda baho uko yambara uko yiga uko yivuza uko arya uko tunga umuryango we ibyo bigenwa nabanyarwanda no Rwanda nta gihugu na kimwe kwisi kigena uko urwanda ruyobora abaruyobora uburyo ruyoborwa n'uburyo rufata abayobozi barwo 
rubabaza ibyo bakora ah ibyo ntabwo bibazwa nabandi byo nibyo abanyarwanda ni cyo nagira ngo nsobanure kuri icyo umuntu akibajije hari gihe mu mateka yacu ibyo mvuze byagenwaga nabandi uko harimo abantu bari bibwiraga ko ari bo bagomba gutunga urwanda kandi niko byari binameze ari bo batugenera uko tubaho bakatugenera uko twambara bakatugenera uko twiga bakatugenera uko twivuza eh baba batabikoze ubwo nyine umunyarwanda akagira ikibazo iye bakatugenera nuko tuyoborwa n'utuyobora ibyo rero byararangiye ntabwo ntabwo nubwo yarakibajije muri context ya Uganda ntabwo ari Uganda gusa ari Uganda ari ibindi bihugu bindi byaba biri kwizima byaba bivuye kwizima ibyo ntabwo bigena uko umunyarwanda urwanda rw'ubu abayeho ibyo rero nicyo tubwira abanyarwanda ngo abanyarwanda ifite igihugu cyabo turacyubaka iki gihugu nicyo kidutunga nicyo kitwigisha nicyo kituvuza nicyo kitwambika nicyo gituma nicyo twubakamo nicyo kidutungira imiryango ntabwo ari ibindi bihugu ibindi tugafatanya iki gihugu abanyarwanda nibo bakiyobora nibo bagena uko kiyoborwa nibo bagena uko ababayobora bajyaho nibo bagena uko bavaho nuko bahanwa iyo batakiro yobora neza ntabwo ari abandi ibyo rwose nagira ngo mbishimangire kubera ko harimo hari ngo wumva abantu bamwe basa naho bibwira ko eh batariho urwanda rutabaho ibyo ndibwira ko ari ukwibeshya no kutamenya igihe no kutamenya ibi gihe ari bihe bigeze um, Ita now Reuters. I don't know why you keep coming back to this closure. Of, it has not been closed. You, but this, I think the media once you pick something, it's difficult for you to change it. Maybe when you've written closed, maybe it goes into the computer and you can't delete. It. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. Gatuna is not closed. It will not be closed. None of Rwanda's borders are closed. Yeah. Um, so that is one. The RNC. The RNC are um, the group which is on the way to disappearing. Uh, they've never had an ag a sensible agenda. They don't have an ideology. Uh, they don't have leadership. They... So, and it will disappear. Our only concern is that on the way to disappearance, it is acti acting with and support of people in Uganda. That is the only problem for us that we see and it should not be a problem between Rwanda and Uganda we don't see why the RNC should be part of any equation between Rwanda and Uganda there's no need for it as far as we are concerned uh, we don't see the logic of it but for some reason, they still are operating in, in Uganda, and that is the awareness we raise. We say, but why is this happening? So that is the challenge there. Uh, but not in itself, I don't think um, they are an issue, a big issue for, for us. They, they, we've sent uh, arrest warrants for some of the leaders who've committed 
crimes here that are leaders of the RNC, where they are, wherever they are. But that is the challenge. Some of the problems which uh, you need to be aware about, maybe which I should say, is that some of these groups uh, act in a manner that simply gives them, they seem to get a voice through uh, activities that they carry out in surrounding countries. For example, you can have an RNC, we've had cases, I will not get into details of them, but we've had cases of an, an RNC operative in Uganda working with some people in Uganda who passes on information to South Africa, another RNC official in South Africa, and then that, that official in South Africa calls Uganda to say, arrest so and so, they are dangerous to you. And that information is deemed to come from South Africa, whereas in actual fact it originated from Uganda. You see what, what I'm talking about? So somebody is in Uganda, works with a Ugandan person, they call South Africa, an NRSA person in South Africa, who then calls Uganda to say, do this to so and so. And then the information is as if it has come from South Africa, therefore it is credible. Whereas in actual fact, it is a group that is in Uganda that has done all this machination. So if you're not careful, you think uh, South Africa has a problem with individual X or with Rwanda, but in actual fact, it is a group of people who are uh, cooking up all these things. So that is why I'm saying that you have to be careful about some of these things. And I have also seen it in the media. Then media picks up something before you know it, uh, it's blown up. So, so some of those problems which we face that people think and are with South Africa, actually originate elsewhere. Originate, as I have said, in, in a um, place like Uganda. And we've seen people arrested, uh, some of them, for these reasons. Now, generals, no, no, I have, uh, I don't know why these social media people want people to be arrested. These generals are here then. I had a meeting with Nzabamnita. Fortunately, with him, at least I know I had a meeting with him yesterday, late last night. And so, uh, these, these are just, uh, I've heard rumors that people are arrested. Uh, the other day, on a lighter note, I was, uh, I thought I was uh, making a point, but also in a bit of a joke. We, we raise serious issues which I've raised here, people respond by saying, but uh, generals are arrested, says Vera has land in Uganda and where. So I was tweeting at the time to say, no, 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 no. Yeah. I don't have property, I don't have land there. I wish I did, I don't. But if I did, it would not be a problem. Yeah. But so what I'm trying to say is, be careful about, these are serious issues. We're discussing serious matters, and then people just divert into non-issues. They create stories about arrests, about troop deployments, about uh, ownership of this and that, uh, who went to study where, for what reason. For that is not the issue, and those are not the issues we're raising. It's not a competition about uh, who did what when. It's about serious state business that um, needs to be addressed. Imirambo ya yaruko rwero hangaha muhora mukimbaza. Every time there's a press conference muita muhora mumbaza imirambo yo muri rwero 
narebabwe nta banyarwanda twebwe amarimbi y'urwanda arazwe rwose nabo bantu babivuga muzababwire amarimbi y'urwanda arazwe aho dushyingura harazwe by law amarimbi yacu ari gazetted ntabwo rweru ari irimbi ry'urwanda rwose nta mirambo y'abanyarwanda ijyayo kandi abo babivuga ntabwo iyo mirambo imwe biri mu biyaga indiri mu bishanga byiwabo indiri mu mazu iwabo aho hava iyo mirambo nahandi ni igomba kuba rivu ariko niba byongera kubivuga aho aho abo bantu babivuga mujye mubabaza mujye mubabwira ko urwanda nta 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 marimbi rweru ntabwo ari irimbi ry'urwanda it will never be amazi y'urwanda ahari migezi yacu amazi y'urwanda atunga abanyarwanda ntabwo tuyashyiramo eh imirambo ntibishoboka so icyo ngira ngo nagisubiza nti ariko muhora mukimbaza for some reason jeni ko nabibabwira yes My name is Colin Moy. I write for the New Times Daily. I have a brief clarification. This is the last series. Oh, okay. You mentioned that uh, Rwanda and Uganda are currently in talks to end the stalemate or, the, or to fix the strained uh, relations. If you could clarify at the moment what has been the development since the travel advisory on Thursday, and in what aspect, in at what level are the talks? And do you have like a mechanism or a special purpose vehicle to fix the the the, the to to end the stalemate, as well as how many Rwandans are currently being apprehended in Uganda by your count? You mentioned 190 over the last two years, but as as of today, how many by you according to you are being held? Thank you. Uh, can I take the last one? I think the two two karangis. Hmm? karangiza and then marakoze nitwa divan wa inkorera rb nifuzaga kubaza ko bijyanye no mu bantu wa Rwanda nandi mahanga muri rusange umwaka ushize twabonye abakuru bihugu nabaza guverinema twavuga ko bari benshi koko ni baba bari ko mwikenda basuye igihugu ngira ngo bifite icyo bisobanuye ku mubano w'u Rwanda n'amahanga kuri mwebwe mu bona ibi byerekana iki hanyuma ese kwa kwitega ko no muri uyu mwaka u Rwanda gukora uzagira abashyitsi bo ku rwego nkuru nguru benshi mu twabonye umwaka ushize hanyuma wenda nasoreza ku kijyanye nuburyo muri iki gihe abanyarwanda bitegura kwibuka ku 25 genocide yakora abatutsi twavuga ko kugeza ubu u Rwanda n'amahanga barakora nabate kugira ngo koko ibikorwa byo kwibuka bijyane no guha ubutabera abarokotse genocide cyane ko diplomasi yo Rwanda ifite uruhare rukomeye mu kugira ngo koko ubutabera buboneke cyane cyane kubasize bakoze genocide cyangwa bakurya mu genocide bari mu bihugu by'amahanga bakoze Thank you very much. My name is Ivan Mujisha. I work with the East African. I have uh, two two questions I need to uh, uh, basically there are some sorts of clarifications. Um, we've been at the borders both uh, both Katuna and 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 uh, and Kajitumba, and uh, it doesn't look like a, an advisory. Would like you to clarify the fact that Rwandans are not allowed to travel to Uganda, uh, whether they know about the advisory or not, uh, whether they try to risk it for their own lives, for their own sake. They are still not they are still not allowed uh, to cross to Uganda for whatever purposes. Um, the second part is about uh, 
uh, uh, Uganda, which has said that uh, uh, truck clearance fees have been increased uh, at Chanika border from 200,000 francs to 400,000 francs. I uh, would like to know whether that's true, and if it's true, uh, is it some form of retaliation for what's going on uh, between uh, Uganda and, and Rwanda? Uh, thank you very much. All right. Uh, the first one about that from Collins. Um, I've said we're in discussions. We've been in discussions for two years. That, that's where you begin from. And those channels continue. Uh, those channels of discussions are open. They continue. Has there been any um, movement forward? No, not yet. We haven't seen any. Uh, but we will continue the, those discussions. Um, now, uh, about your Bozibas, we Uganda, no, because she's a hard girl. When you buy your Bozibas, you can show us your Uganda. Quite a month, the Tandu can you name the Mozi, Harina, Maya, Yumuria, Africa. African Union Summit hari nibindi byazanya abayobozi benshi eh n'uyu mwaka ari abayobozi bakuri bihugu bazaza eh ntabwo navuga umubare wabo ariko hari mbo bamwe bazaza bazaza mu kwibuka bazaza muri CEO forum nabandi hari nabavu nabaje basubiyeyo former PMs mu Madagascar turutse aha nabandi so bazaza um kuri kwibuka jenoside ya kuri wa tutsi ku nshuro ya 25 turabif kuzabera mu Rwanda ariko nabanyarwanda baba mu mahanga nabo bafite ibikorwa bateganije bakoranye na ambassade zacu zose ari bikorwa biteganyijwe byo kwibuka ndetse bafatanyamo n'ishuti z'u Rwanda ambassade zacu abanyarwanda bo mu mahanga ari ishuti z'u Rwanda hari nibihugu nabanyamahanga nabo bazaza kwifatanya natwe n'u Rwanda mu kwibuka babara abayobozi batandukanye n'izi nshuti z'u Rwanda ngo tuzaba turi kumwe twibuka genocide yakora abatutsi ushobora mu 2025 ndetse tunatangira kwibuka ko iyo genocide yahagaritswe n'abanyarwanda kandi abanyarwanda buraho bubakikiwe cyubu cyabo yafo hari kwibuka genocide yakora abatutsi ariko na no kwibohora kwacu abanyarwanda nako kumaze imyaka 2025 abanyamahanga rero benshi nshuti z'u Rwanda bazaza kwifatanya natwe ku bimwe mu byo dusaba amahanga no gukomeza inzira yo guhana bakoze genocide muri iki gihugu bakiba mu bihugu by'amahanga biro biratera intambwe ariko ntabwo bigenda ntabwo byihuta uko twa byifuza gari ko hari ibihugu bimwe batubwira ko bagiye gushyiramo imbaraga habo mu bubirigi aba aba mu bwongereza haba mu faransa haba muri za netherlands ari ibihugu bona no the countries ari ibihugu bona biro bishyiramo imbaraga hari nibihugu ku mugabane wa afrika batangiye ku korana natwe kureba uko iki kibazo abantu bakoze bakiri hanze nabo bagezwe ku butabera bamwe barabaza nabantu muri ababona bya za Malawi hari nabandi dukorana Zambia nabandi zimbye bizakomeza cyakabiri nuko twasabye ko ibihugu bifite inyandiko zi mu bubiko bwabyo zijyanye na genocide yakorewe abatutsi igihe kigeze kugira ngo E, nazo bazidusangize kugira ngo aya mateka yacu yuzure hari ibihugu byinshi kubera ko byari byicaye ku muryango byabaga mu muryango w'ubibumbye cyo gihe biri muri security council bifite inyandiko kuri cyo gihe 
cya genocide tubasaba ko izo nyandiko bazitusangiza kandi bariho bara byinshi biratubwira ko bitegura kubikora kugira ngo naya imyaka ko tumaze imyaka 25 namateka eh yacu nayo akomeze kuzura bena as for Ivan Gishas questions I I will not uh, use your words uh, you you asking me to use words that are yours they are not mine my words are Rwandans are strongly advised not to cross into Uganda to go to Uganda and those words have a meaning and so those are the words we are using and I'm sure Rwandans uh, understand them um, as you have seen yourself at the border uh, now for clearance fees I don't know I, I will ask I don't know what I don't even know what the clearance fees were now I don't know where they stand that I'll ask I I can't give you an answer to that one because I don't know um, very good thank you very much thank you very much honorable minister this uh, brings uh, this press conference to an end we thank you for your time and we thank uh, the member of the press who attended today's press conference, Naokoze Nahuta.